Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. Guys, <laughs> I'm smiling because uh, Uland has just been performing absolutely well. I'm going to break it down some more, bring you another video on this. Uh, I want to explain the price because we have seen an absolute insane pump <laughs> in 24 hours. Mad, crazy, ludicrous. Bum. I'm going to break down if it's still a good buy because I tell you what, as crazy as this pump is, you are still... <laughs> <laughs> you're still super early to this project because it's sitting on a 9 million market cap and I'm going to compare the land because you know the land for uh, you land is probably the most expensive land that you're going to buy in cryptocurrency now and this is going to spark a lot more attention because I'll tell you what you land if you continue to go the way you go developers continue to do what you do you can seriously give projects like the Sandbox and Decentraland a good run for its money. What do I mean? I can imagine, I can see a scenario where people will take, well, the market cap sizes, look at 4 billion, I can see some of the market cap coming out of, you know, Decentraland and Sandbox and coming into you land. Uh, guys, if it sounded interesting to you so far, please drop that like, give me a subscribe if you're new watching. Before I dive into this, and I need to show you what I bought because I did buy some more. Uh, before I dive into this, I need to let you know, I am not a fan financial advisor. These are my own personal opinions on the market. Please do your further research before you invest your money. I have to say that. Even if you make crazy gains with me, I still have to say it because, you know, I'm not a financial advisor. Uh, but so far looking good. Let's talk about, where should we start? Let's first talk about Uland, uh, the coin. Is it still worth buying? I think it is. Matter of fact, I still think it's worth buying the land. And I want to really stress this to you. And I tell you what, there's still time. You should seriously consider grabbing some land if you can. Uh, and if you want to, I've made it super simple for you guys. Click my link in the description. It takes you straight here. Super simple. Click here. Uh, so wherever, get it out. So referral link as well. So, you know, might help me on my, on my journey. Might help you as well on your journey. Uh, so I don't know if they give you stuff. Sometimes they do. Sometimes they don't. Uh, but you, I'm pointing at my screen. Connect your wallet. And then you will be able to buy some land. Uh, I, I thought I connected my wallet. I don't know why it's not showing connect. Uh, and what you do is you click on buy land. It does take you to pancake swap, but I want to show you another way because some people were trying to rush to buy and they couldn't put their orders through and it kept coming back as foul. So I'm going to show you another way as well. Uh, I would recommend, uh, well, like I said, click the link, set yourself up, connect your wallet. Once your wallet's connected, uh, you can also come over to uh, pancake, sorry, not pancake, ape swap to buy the, the tokens, right? So you buy the tokens. Uh, I'm saying ape swap. <laughs> poo coins! Because I went on ape swap earlier. Anyway, uh, poo coins. You come over to poo coins app. You search uh, Uland token. Uh, if you want, you can, you know, come over to Gar uh, <laughs> Coin Gecko. Click on the contract. You can tell what I've been doing in my day, switching different coins and whatnots, and you know, taking rewards. What I have. Uh, you copy the address. You come over to Poo Coins. You can paste the address in. It should show the coin exactly. Be careful because times like now, you will see, see fake coins come up. But if you use the contract address from CoinGecko, slam it into here. <laughs> Just slam it. Put it into here. It will come up like this. Well, it comes up like this, which shows absolute... <laughs> The price is just insanely euphoric right now. Uh, I'll turn this off for a second. I want to show you, click on trade. Keep this green because if you don't have it green, it will. you'll have to figure out the slippage. And that's what I'm trying to tell you to come here because when you go on pancake swap, the reason it's not going through is because you can't work out the slippage. It's going to keep changing. Some people are rushing to buy so they're increasing their slippage. This just does it automatically. You come over here, click auto slippage, and then you click buy. And then you should be able to buy the tokens or swap. Swap it. Now, once you've done that, you come back over to here. You can then click on buy land. There should be a place where it says buy land. Let me refresh it because uh, because I want to show you. Uh, buy land. Here we go. So you buy land. You click on this and then it should show you all the different types of land you can buy. Guys, again, link in the description. Super simple. Takes you straight here. Uh, you get rewards as well. So when you buy, because you can buy different types of things. Like I said, you can buy countries. You can buy uh, cities. I would recommend, and I'm strongly going to still recommend it, guys, Buy the cities because 
the cities are still on sale. You can get them relatively cheap. And you might look at like, <laughs> that says 820,000, uh, but that's owned by someone. Hold on, let's have a look. Uh, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you what, you can click on grid, because I know there's some uh, cheap cities that are still happening right now that you can buy. So you can come over here where it says all countries. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, take off tier one. All you want to focus on is tier two, which is the land sale right now, which is, I believe is still happening. You can get them cheap. And this is priced lowest to highest. See up here, top right corner, lowest to highest. Guys, 67,000 is the cheapest city you can get right now. Why do I tell you to get a city? Because it's still super tiny. Guys, we're dealing with a nine million market cap it has serious potential to blow meaning i still think that you can 10x your money i still think you can 100x your money i seriously do and i'm gonna show my reasons why in a second because i'm gonna put, uh, compare against the sandbox the central land and show you my verdict right but going back to this you're still looking at a great buy where's it gone here we go uh so once you're in this grid view you've ch you've come over there you've taken tier one off because you just want to focus on what's the pre you know the nice little land sale that's going on right now Set it to lowest price. These are the ones you want to grab quick and easy. 62,700 land is what that's, uh, U land tokens is what it will cost. So let's have a look. 67,000. What did I say? <laughs> just forget it straight away, you know. 62,720. <laughs> 6, 6, I just want to show you 62,720. What are you, okay, you're looking at about 1,000 pounds. Now, to you, it, okay, it's a bit of money. You know, average people, I say, you know, if you're gonna invest into something, a thousand pounds would be like an average investment. So, you know, that's sitting in that bracket range of what I usually tell people to invest if you can afford it. A thousand pounds for a piece of land now with a coin that's sitting on a penny and a half with the market cap at nine million ish. <laughs> If it does that 10x again, like I believe it can do, the price also does a 10x. So you'd be looking at a 90 million market cap, super doable, just under 100 million. The price of this will 10x. So you'd be looking at a uh, 14 pence price. Your land now becomes super valuable because your land isn't worth uh, what's it called? Uh, 62,700. Well, it'll still be worth the same ULAN tokens, but it's not worth a, a thousand pounds anymore. 966. It's now worth almost 10 grand. That's what I'm getting at. And to prove my point, I'm going to show you what I bought because I did buy and I forgot to show it in my last video. Guys, check the video out here. Left hand side, check it. ULAN, the biggest virtual land metaverse to do a 1000X. It's not a joke. This is becoming, you know, the most expensive land in the, the crypto space. And I'm going to explain my reasons. Look, look at this. Look, if you wanted to buy a country now as well as an example, I wouldn't recommend it, guys. I said you wouldn't. I bought Chad. <laughs> it cost me a bit. And for the longest time, I was deciding, should I, should I not? But I want to own a country. So I bought Chad, you know, not far off from, you know, my Nigeria. <laughs> As my mum would say, my mum would be like, why didn't you buy Nigeria? Well, well mummy, because <laughs> you know I'm half Nigerian, right? <laughs> well, well, mummy, um, I, I, it wasn't for sale, mummy, so you go and buy Chad. Why, why you buy this thing for? Well, mummy, it's all I could, why are you laughing? Okay, I'm going to stop. Uh, <laughs> so, you know, I bought Chad, happy with the purchase. I'm going to see what it brings, because it does bring in passive income. Whether you buy a country or a city, you're going to earn passive income. This rewards right here will increase. So that's why I'm telling you, you know, grab it now, you know, get into the tier two. Uh, again, all I ask is click the link in my description. It takes you straight to here and then start grabbing these ones that are blue. Look, because the light blue is still available in this land cell, right? Is this right? Yeah, they're not owned by anyone. And you can tell if they're owned by someone because it shows the name. Uh, let me just show you. So these aren't, look, 62,000. That's, is that? Oh, that's in my region. Well, if you want to buy that, go ahead. <laughs> well, I'm saying that, uh, you know, these blue ones, you can still get them relatively cheap compared to what it's going to be worth when this price of the coin does an extra 10x. So, and if you wanted to buy like an entire country now, guys, it's not a joke. Some of these countries, like I'll zoom in and keep it real. Look, some of these countries here, like, you know, Germany, you're looking at, because <laughs> yesterday it was like, uh, what, 4 BNB, 5 BNB, now you're talking, no, that was about 20, I think yesterday it was like 200 BNB for Germany, whoever's got that, you're just sitting large, I know, you're, I know what you're doing, 
costs 44 million ULAN tokens. Or 1,300 BNB, you're talking half a million pounds. People ain't got that, unless you're rich. Maybe there's some rich people watching me. If you are, you might be interested in owning a country. If you are, Germany's for sale at that price. Could be a good buy. Because I tell you what, when you own a country, you earn extra rewards. Like what they said on how it works. I'm just going to break it down again, <clears throat> just to help you guys understand. So when you own a country or a city, let's work it out. They do, like I said, there's two different tiers. So if you're in tier one, you will, if you have a tier one, uh, land, you will earn 5%, I'm trying to find it <laughs> somewhere here, uh, you will earn 5 what's this? Just checking that, you know, it looks good, it, does it say here? 5% uh, somewhere? Okay, ish, you will earn 5% every time someone buys a, uh, a city inside your country if the sales are going, you know, the transactions, because when people buy and sell, you still earn rewards, right? I believe you earn 5% for owning a country, and then on top of that, if you own a city, they earn 2.5% or something like that for each transaction that's happening. So if for some reason we see a correction now, because, uh, you know, the, you know ugh, there's so much I want to talk about. The charts are so FOMO'd and euphoric that there should be a correction. And I tell you what, when I bought my land just now, my country, I bought it round about here. And I expect it to come down. Why am I not worried? Because... I believe it will come down healthy, you know, because you can't you can't have an insane 300 and something percent pump over the last day or two because, you know, it's not showing what it was before and not come down for correction. But in saying that, I I remember seeing Cardano at a penny and a half. <laughs> and I, I was saying, I'll just wait. And I'll just wait. It might come back down again. <laughs> Four pence. I'll just wait. It's got to come down now because it's like 400 percent. I'll just wait. <laughs> 12 pence, it was just going up and up, so uh, <laughs> what I'm saying is, it can still go up, and as much as you're waiting for a pullback, look, this could go up to 20, 30, 40, I don't know what it's going to hit, it might, it might correct now, it could go up to 10 pence, and then correct, it could go up to 15 pence, and then correct, maybe it's not finished having its run, I don't know, And but the reason I think it can still go up is because the market cap, still so tiny seriously tiny you're you're dealing with a gem i've said it before and i can't say it again when you go to agrabah because you get on your camera you travel to agrabah and you see jafar with his parrot in the in the desert yeah because you go through that desert <laughs> he tells you to bring in the lamp bring me the lamp the rest is yours but the lamp is mine okay man <laughs> and you go in that cave of wonders and you touch nothing but the lamp <laughs> and you rub that lamp and then you land pops out and you're sitting large okay <laughs> I, I had to do it uh, i love it um but now nah, <laughs> real talk keeping it cool real talk i do expect a pullback uh and if it does you're gonna make nice juicy rewards through the sales which is why i wasn't i, I didn't mind buying uh, a country now when i could because <laughs> you are going to receive let me see tokenomics does it show here you're going to receive rewards for when it, but when people buy and sell let me refresh this page it's not loading properly usually it loads properly uh, let me refresh it when you own a country though uh, and again if you can afford it fine but i i'm, I'm, I'm saying going for this right here the minting phase because this is where you're going to get absolute cheap prices for your coin uh, for your buys which can seriously help you make insane gains in the future uh but when you mint these and you, you you know and you're sitting there just chilling you're earning rewards so when you own a city you're earning rewards uh i, I don't know what it is what you're going to be earning in relation to rewards but you know we can break it down have a look because they say it's based on population uh let's have a look here so um just trying to read it real, uh, real quick because uh, it talks about population somewhere. Uh, where's the population bit? Uh, buying sales and blah, blah, blah. Here we go. So, number seven. Uland also has its own currency, which is Uland token. Yep, fine, we know that. Every time someone buys or sells our token, you receive a percentage of transactions based on the population of the lands. Which then again, you're probably thinking, well, of all the countries, why did he buy Chad? Well, I'm going to break it down because there were a few countries. Look. You can click, click on tier to buy a country, uh, tier one. But again, I recommend going for the 
early, you know, land sale, the pre-land sale, which is going to get you stuff cheap. Uh, big up to Guatemala. I know who you are. <laughs> One of my patrons, big up to you. You're sitting large. I see you. Uh, I just want to talk about uh, this in relation to. Um, hold on, let me see. Is this? Low, hold on, let me let me uh, pull it on like this. Uh, I'm just doubling myself. I wanted to show you population. Here we go. Uh, so right now, this is just countries, right? So you can buy a country right here, French Southern Territories, for two hundred and seventy-five thousand new land, but it has a population of a hundred and forty. Do you see it here? I went for one that one had more population because the more population that you have in your country the more rewards you will earn so even though it's good to have a country like this remember you only have a population of 140 so that's what i was paying attention to i was looking for one that had you know high population you know 33,000 high you know what's let's keep going down look this one here uh guinea 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 bissau ah how you pronounce it it's got 1.8 million population so that could be a good one to earn good passive rewards you see what i'm saying so this is you know when, when you come back to what i bought now uh what did i buy <laughs> chad let's just search chad it has a high population right here chad it has 15 million 400 in population which be i believe i should start earning some nice rewards so you know i'm gonna sit back and wait and see what happens with that uh, i also bought what else did i buy let's have a look i also bought france well not, not france i bought a city in france i bought uh what is it this one here is it this one no that's france i bought which one did i buy <laughs> Kind of a here. So here we go. I bought Paris. <laughs> I bought Paris, guys, because I think you know. Should this continue to perform well? It says locked. <laughs> Why are you locking me for? Uh, should it continue to perform well? I seriously believe that this is going to be a good buy. And uh, let me see if I can switch it over to. It's, Why are you telling me I'm locked? That's my. There we go. It's it's, it's changed color now. Uh, I seriously think that when it comes to them releasing, you know, landmarks like the Eiffel Tower and things like that, they say this in their uh, white paper and stuff. That's where you guys are going to make insane gains because you're going to be buying rare landmarks like the Eiffel Tower, the all the other ones that are in uh, uh, Paris and all these other places. And that's where you make insane gains. I'll probably be making nice gains because people are buying the, the rare landmarks. And yeah, so that's why I was, I was happy to buy this. How much did I spend? I don't usually like talking about what I spent, but I'll be transparent with you on France, okay? I'll be transparent with you on France. Uh, I spent on France... I spent it's mad and it has a big population as well I think it's like similar to like the city to the, to the uh, country I just bought trust me big population I spent 4 million and that was you land tokens right so let me just show you what it was back then because you know I bought it 002 you take 4 million and times it by a point zero zero two because we were buying it cheap again if you was a patron of mine you saw the alerts we were buying it cheap man we bought it cheap cheap I can't say it like that because if I just say we bought it cheap it doesn't have that effect i bought it cheap uh i want to show you how much i spent and i, I know to you we're looking at this like eight grand he, th he thinks eight eight grand it doesn't sound cheap but when you're when you're dealing with land and you know virtual land and all this stuff because i tell you what if you want to go and buy on the sandbox <laughs> You're going to be looking to spend about 30 grand, 40, 50 grand, I'm telling you now, for one parcel. I know this because I keep getting people bidding on mine. Uh, same with Decentraland. Some of them are selling for like a million. I think Uland is going to seriously bump up and people will be paying, paying crazy money for it. So, you know, eight grand back then was cheap. How much is it worth now? Well, look, if I was to just sell my France for the exact same price as what I... U tokens that I paid, which is four million, look in one day, in one day, I'm looking there in one day. It's gonna. <laughs> if I sold France right now for the same amount of tokens that I paid for it, I'm looking at sixty grand. <laughs> I turn eight grand into sixty grand in one day, twenty four hours. That's not a joke. But I wouldn't sell it for that. I would sell it for more because I think it's worth more. And I think when these landmarks and all these other things come in, it's going to be worth more. And all you guys are going to be making insane gains when you buy things like the Eiffel Tower. Uh, again, if you don't want to miss this opportunity, 
click the link in the description it's there grab some land guys get yourself as much as you can the land sell here this is what you want to pay attention to public sell tier two assets because they're cheap i'm telling you I'm, get it out i'm telling you they're cheap uh right let's just talk a bit more about this nine million market cap let's take a look at the dissension land and the sandboxes they have a three billion market well sandbox 3.8 billion and the reason i'm showing you this is because i really want to compare because you you you'd you be sitting there because i've got a lot of people saying to me ah oh, i've missed it now oh no i've missed the opportunity you ain't missed nothing it's sitting on a nine million market cap when you compare you land and i know it's had an insane pump but when you compare you land to the sandbox and i've got to compare it to them now because it's sitting large like that it's it's at a nine million market cap and the land is worth the same amount of what these are <sighs> can you imagine how much you land land is going to be worth when it goes to these kind of mark <sighs> gets to the market caps this central land is four million 4.6 or whatever sandbox is 3.8 what would happen if you land went to something like that like a three billion market cap. I just want to put it out there to you because it can be possible. It seriously can be. Look, three billion. Actually, I'm going to take the exact market cap of Sandbox because I want to keep it super real. I want to show you everything in pure detail. What if it went there? If it went there, I don't need it to go there, and I don't need it to go there for either any of us. Because I tell you what, we just need it to hundred x, which is what hundred million market cap. <laughs> no, uh, one billion market cap. We'll get there. That's at the price today. 1 billion market cap at the price today. Look at this, look. Divide it by, uh, what did I say, Ulan's thingy is right here. Copy, and I'm going to paste this in. Because, you know, when it comes to investing, you guys need to see this stuff clearly, man. Uh, you're looking at a 394x gain. If Ulan goes to where Sandbox is and Decentraland is, 394 times your money back at the time of you getting in now. At the price now. Forget what you missed now. <laughs> That's insane gains because if you had a thousand pounds, just saying, and you held on to whatever it's land or whatever you buy land or just a coin, you're making 394 times your money back. That's 394 grand. Who's paying attention? Because I said to you, <laughs> I'm going to make a video so fast when it goes to 39 pence and I believe it will go there. Um, uh, let me just uh, show you what it would look like if it's sat on a hundred X from now right so we're looking at this market cap here because i believe it's still in the cards i seriously do seriously seriously do uh, uh times it by a hundred a hundred times your money back i see this happening hunt if you had a hundred pounds you only wanted to you know just invest a bit of money again this is not investment advice i can only show you what i'm doing what i'm showing my patrons they're making insane gains on this and I'm just telling you that in my perspective of being in this market for a long period of time, a 9 million market cap is mega tiny. Please don't underestimate it. Don't sit there and go, I'll, I'll just wait. It might come down, but don't underestimate the price because it's a small market cap. Once people, more people pay attention, it can rise fast. Like I said, you see these crap coins pumped to like a billion market cap. You see meme coins with no use case pumped to crazy market caps. You've got a serious play to earn, which feels like a serious business type of module, like a business game right here. I don't know, do you want to call it a game? I don't know, but it feels like a business to me. <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, that's making insane gains for everyone. Uh, let me just go back to this 100X. You're looking at a 967 million market cap, just under a billion, just under a billion. If the alt season is to continue to rise, because, you know, we've seen a fall down in prices, do you not think this is going to go up with it? Because I do. <laughs> I seriously do. Uh, and, uh, this here is very realistic for a type of project like this with land that's worth a million pounds right now. You best believe some of the land. Uh, 900, ugh, and it's only been out how long? A month. 967 million market cap. What does it do to the price? Look at this. Times 10. One pound, uh, sorry, 14 pence times 100, one pounds 42. <laughs> if it hits that, everybody that's watching this video now and buying, you're going to make absolute insane gains. I'm telling you now, and I'm not trying to hype this project up. I'm just trying to show you what I see. Look, I see data. I see the supply. I see the market cap. I'm just showing you data. I'm showing you what I see, okay? So... You know, I had to share this with you. It's super possible, super doable. Um, and I still have some, you know, land tokens, you land on the side. Because, you know, it's good to have 
some new land tokens and it's good to have some land as well so i'm gonna sit back and see what happens with this what kind of passive income i'll make uh and i'll definitely be bringing more on this guys if you don't want to miss this stuff because you know i'm gonna try and get you more projects like this become a patreon i got seven tiers take your pick I recommend going for my exclusive VIP partner tier. Why? Because that unlocks my posts. All my posts. Let me open this. You can see when I buy, when I sell, when I stake, when I do it all. It's all in here. You see the post. It comes on as soon as I've done it. You don't miss nothing. If you want that little bit more, go for my CEO tier. Why? Just saying. You don't have to. If you can afford it, it gives you my super alerts. You get access to my VIP Telegram group. I talk to you way before I buy, I sell, way before I do anything. It's all in there. They saw this. I was talking to them about it at point zero zero two yesterday. <laughs> yesterday, oh my travel seems so far away. Uh, anyway, uh, <laughs> just got to say, look, it's still going up. Uh, a penny and a half now. So I'm gonna see what happens in the long run. You land is doing nice for me i can say right now because you know spending eight grand and turning it into 60 grand and owning a sixty thousand pound piece of land is mad crazy ludicrous but because if it does the 10x my god if it does that extra 10x and it goes to 15 pence my land is worth half a million more than half a million because half, half a million half. it's more than half because <laughs> You know when someone says how much you want to say, can I have half please? <laughs> anyway, uh, it's more than half because it's going to be 600,000 for a piece of land. What kind of rewards are you going to earn? It's just mind boggling to think. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here. I'm not going to go any further. Wanted to share some stuff with you. You know how to buy it, guys. Click the link in my description. Come, once you've done that, if you don't want to buy it here, if you pancake and fiddle with the slippage, come over to uh, uh, Poo Coins. Get it right, Poo Coins. Paste in the address, it shows up like this. Change whatever uh, you want to pay with, and then just buy yourself some land. Then come back over, and then you can buy the, the actual land. You know, you click on the map and hover over to wherever you want to buy, and then you can buy it. It's not sure. Oh, here we go. And then you can buy it. Tier two. Look for the tier twos, nice and cheap. Uh, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you guys for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Cheers.